Welcome to Pig Jimmy, you could call me DJ, and hello to the bushel of bad apples. Today we have a very special video. You see, Rabbit Air was kind enough to send me their new Rabbit Air A3 air purifier to test out, and I am so happy that they did. I've had it in my bedroom for the past seven-ish days, just kind of seeing how it did, how it performed in my, my home environment with my two dogs and just my two kids and just carpeted room and kind of wanted to see how it would handle that kind of general living environment. And then today, we're in the garage, we're smoking a cigar, we're seeing how it handles that as well. And I gotta say, I gotta tell you, I gotta spoil alert before we hop into the voiceover while I go over some of the great things about this unit. Spoiler alert, super impressed, super happy, and I am just digging this awesome unit that comes in a pick Jimmy Green with the mood lighting. So without further to do, let's hop on into the voiceover where I can give you some more information on the Rabbit Air A3 before I give you my full review. Check it out. Introducing the Rabbit Air A3. This plug and play beauty offers six layers of purification and covers spaces up to 1,000 square feet. It's incredibly simple to operate and near silent in day-to-day -day use. And while I love that it is equipped with a sleek and modern design, it's the performance that matters most. As mentioned, this unit offers six layers of filtration or purification. A pre-filter that traps and reduces large size allergens, dust, and particles. A medium filter that traps and reduces smaller air pollutants such as pollen, mold, and pet dander. A high-grade granule activated carbon filter to combat odors, fumes, smoke, and VOCs. A BioGS HEPA filter to trap and reduce the smallest of airborne allergens and bacteria. A customizable filter to fit your best need. Rabbit Air allows you to choose from germ defense, pet allergy, odor remover, or toxin absorber. And the sixth layer of protection is the capability of this unit to utilize negative ions. Negative ions are odorless, tasteless, and invisible molecules that are found near mountains, waterfalls, and beaches. Some research studies show that negative ions help alleviate depression and boost mental energy. Additionally, negative ions help your air purifier by latching onto airborne particles, thus weighing them down and allowing them to be more easily captured by the air filters. The Rabbit Air A3 is complete with mood lighting and an easy to use, very intuitive app. This is the newest and smartest addition to the Rabbit Air purifier family. As you can see, the A3 just does a phenomenal job of just, it just sucks that smoke right into the filter, cleaning the air, removing the odor. Not only does it look nice, I mean, it has a cool RGB light here, several different settings, so the mood light, I call it. Obviously, I'm keeping on a pick Jimmy Green because me and Rabbit Air, I'm match made in heaven. Now, I do not have any type of a deal with Rabbit Air. They're not sponsoring this video. I'm gonna ask them, hey, you wanna send me one? I'd love to try this thing out because a couple of reasons. One, I smoke in a garage. It's an enclosed garage. I smoke with the garage doors most of the time closed. Um, still exposes me to the element, which is why this thing is running on high and the fact that I have a cigar up in its business. But on top of that, um, you know, is it the, I don't like the fact that I, to get my lighting as it is, I'm in, in a very enclosed room. It makes my garage stink like cigars for a very long time sometimes. I have a Christmas tree that hangs up above my head and it stinks like cigars come Christmas time. And this unit has already helped my bedroom. My bedroom is carpeted. It's one of the few rooms in my home that is carpeted. I have dogs. I've had a total of four dogs in this carpet since 2017 when I moved in here. And let's be honest, Carpet makes your house smell. It locks in odors. You can clean your carpet. You can deodorize your carpet. You can do a little sprinkly dust, but it's still gonna retain some form of odor and that odor is gonna be trapped in the air. It was odor, the odor was cranked up to high and I'm like, wow, judge me much rabbit air. But you know what? After about 30 minutes, the fan slowly like turned that knock down. Another 30 minutes, knock down. Within about an hour and a half, I, could, I thought this thing was off. I was like, great, it's off already. What's going on? I hold my hand over it. No, light little breeze. I bust out my, my Rabbit Air app. I'm looking at it. Odor's all the way gone. Took an hour and a half to deodorize my room and it smelt fantastic scents. It does a really good job at deodorizing rooms, which is super cool. It's due to its six layers of air filtration and one of them is an odor layer. It's a carbon filter, sucks in, removes odor. That's why it's fantastic for cigars and it's noticeable. It's a noticeable change in the quality of air. I keep this in my bedroom and when I go from my living room to my bedroom, it is a very noticeable change in the way the air feels. And part of that 
is due to this cool thing right here that I, I went over in the, the voiceover. It has negative ions, or it has the ability to imbue in the air with negative ions. Now, negative ions may be like a pseudoscience, but essentially what it says is in the air, in the places like the mountains, the beach, when you're out in the fresh, fresh air, the air that's crisp and, crisp and pure, <laughs> the air that is crisp and pure and away from pollutants, um, there's negative ions in that, and that's part of what gives you that nice, that 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 healthy mental state, supposedly, according to, to negative ions. I've had this on for the past week in my bedroom. It might be a placebo effect. It might be pseudoscience, but it feels different with it on. And I love the app. I love the app interface on the Rabbit Air 3. It's really nice. It's really clean. It's really simple. The only thing I wish it went into more information on is the air purification settings. And while it does tell you like, hey, right now the density is PM, the PM1 density is high or the PM2.5 density is high or the PM10 density is high, it doesn't tell you what that is. It'd be really cool if the app had links to videos on Rabbit Air's website that you could click on and they explained what these pollutants are, what these air air impurifications are, what these what these things in the air are, and why it's good to have low density, what the unit's doing. I wish it did that. Some further education. Um, do I think the majority of people are, are gonna do that? No. Do I think the people that are gonna buy a unit that, that is the price tag that is this? Possibly. I love the fact that this thing can be in my garage. I also love the fact that it's not very heavy. If you wanna move this thing from room to room, you absolutely can. I, I am thinking that this is gonna live in two places, either in my bedroom or I'm gonna take that JC Newman thing off the wall and I'm gonna mount it in here. But regardless, if I'm gonna be in this garage, it might not be on camera in the future, but it's gonna be in here with me. Looking forward to testing out how well this thing actually sucks the odor out. If I close the garage doors, leave it in here for like an hour, come back, check. I'll leave it in here for another hour, come back, check. And I'll let you know, because there's been times my wife parks on the other side of the garage. She's left windows down in her fabric car and I didn't realize it and it stunk up the car and it took a long time to get that smell out. So I'm looking forward to seeing how well this thing can do that and that's the next test that I'm gonna do. So overall, you heard all the great positive information, the aesthetics of this thing, you've checked the, vo you know, I went over all the great features that this thing has in the voiceover because I love doing that. Anytime a company is going to send me a product to review, I'm going to give you the best, most high-end product review I can do. I'm going to be honest. If this thing sucked, if I felt like it didn't do shit to my room, I would let you know. This has been great. Um, the other reason I really, really was hoping Rabbit Air would send this to me, I have had horrific allergies this summer. Normally, I don't. Normally, fall, eh, winter, and eh, spring when it's raining and all the shit's coming alive, my head sucks. But usually by summer, that dies and I'm clear. Not this summer. I've had bad, bad, bad allergies. A week with this thing in my room and I have had so much better mornings. I wake up not clogged up. I don't have as bad, as bad allergies. I was doing nasal flushes at least every other day until I started using this and now I've only done it once this week. That's awesome. Like just to have to, I already have a morning routine I have to go through with my teeth, having to do my sinuses and then my ears. Oh, it was such a pain. And using this has helped that. I really, really, I, I, again, I have no affiliation with Rabbit Air other than the fact that they were very kind enough to send me this to review. I have no code for you. I have no discount. I have no link to their website for you. I have nothing related between me and Rabbit Air. This thing is awesome. Next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna finish smoking this cigar. I'm gonna let this thing sit and suck in as much as it can and see how long it takes. And this is a three car garage. So this is not a super small space. It's not a thousand foot space, which this thing is regulated to um, work up to. It works up to a thousand square feet. And I'll see y'all in just a minute with the final update and let you know how well it actually deodorized this room. See you in a bit. Okay, so it's the next day. I let this thing run in the garage for about a total of four hours with the garage doors completely shut. Um, I came in and I checked on it periodically. After about 20 minutes, this section of the garage that I'm in 
was pretty much cigar smell free. Now the other half of the garage did take about the full four hours. So that is quicker than it normally is for me. Uh, typically what I've used to done before, before using the Rabbit uh, uh, A3 here, I used to just open up both doors of the garage, let my fan run and kind of pump the smell out and then close the doors. And if I smoked at night, sometimes in the morning, it still smelled uh, cigar-y. Like you could still smell the cigar smoke smell. I popped the doors open for maybe 10 minutes, close the doors back down, um, and I just, I left it. There's, you can still smell cigars, but in any case there was any cigar smoke lingering, it, you know, it had a chance to leave. Um, couldn't really smell cigars. I come back in the next day, completely gone. I come back in here the next morning, completely gone. No cigar smell at all. So it definitely helps. And I bet if I were to let this thing run, uh, over, overnight, uh, or even just let it run for a full, like six hours in here, it probably would have absorbed everything. This is the rabbit air minus a three sent to me for free from rabbit air to just test out and make a review and i'm happy to do it it's going to get a whole lot of use out of it from me i'm definitely going to keep using this thing i love the mood lighting that i can match to my signs it's just really cool i dig it thank you rabbit air uh if you guys want to check it out i will put rabbit air's link in the description but there's no like special marketing or tracking link to me i'm just going to link out to the unit itself so you can go check it out learn more information if yourself one other thing i didn't mention uh this kind of face plate right here that's magnetized they sell a whole bunch of customized options so if you don't want just black you don't want just white you want to kind of make it match your kind of the way you've decorated uh the way you've decorated your room they have a whole bunch of options and this plate here can be rotated upside down because they do recommend that if you hang this on the wall above six feet that you hang the unit upside down so instead of having the rabbit air logo kind of upside down while it's on the wall you can just flip this thing up so you have it nice and it doesn't look funky that it's upside down it's really cool it's very versatile it's very um intuitive it's it's plug and play you don't need to I didn't even really read the manual. I looked it up and it's it's pretty simple. Plug it in, turn it on, remove the plastic before you turn it on and set up an account on the app. Super simple, super easy. So I'm super excited to keep using it. Hopefully you found this information uh, interesting and this review comprehensive. That way you can really understand what you get with the Rabbit Air, maybe some of its flaws, some of the things that I personally really like about it. But as always, thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing, all of those YouTuber things. And as always, you could call me DJ. Thanks for watching, PJ. I will see you in the next video. Peace.